What's up, Squat Squad? In today's video, we got Squatch Customs. Now, we ain't been on this series in a little bit, and there's a lot changed. We got rid of the Ram Longhorn. We sold the Ford Any Level and the 51 Chevy. I got some rims and another suspension ordered for this. Uh, we're going to start decking this out and really turn it into a nice pickup. Now we got rid of the Longhorn, but I got a 24 Ram Limited on order. And it should be here in the next couple days. So we got the first gen on the rack again. And we're going to start working on it get it ready. And... We got the Squatch Customs decal on the truck. Man, that looks good on there. And we got a few odds and ends here and there. And we got a few customers coming today. So let's get into this. We had to clean it up. It was starting to get a little dirty. So, all right. In today's episode, let's get into this. I'm going to I'm gonna look at what we can get for this first gen. And we'll get this thing up, get it started. And we'll wait on our first customer. Alright guys, our first customer's here. Ooh, that's a nice Cadillac. Welder. Alright. We'll see what he needs and and we'll get her done. Alright guys, so he's got the Alcoas on it, and he's ordered the uh, Corley One forged rims, and he's got them with him, and we're going to get this checked up, and get them swapped out, and get them out of here. Alright guys, there they are, we got them on, didn't take too long, man that really sets that truck off. Well, let's get them out of here. Yeah, buddy, you ready to go? Alright guys, so uh, our parts truck is here, delivering our rims, uh, some of our suspension parts, and uh, some other parts for customers that's been ordered. So we're going to get this unloaded, get it in the shop, and get them out of here. Alright guys, get that shut. Alright buddy, he's empty, he can uh, head on now. Make sure, yep, that's everything. Have a good trip, buddy. All right, guys. Well, that means we can get the uh, 23.4 in the shop. And let's get this going. Alright squad squad, let's tear into this truck and get it going. Alright squad squad, we got another customer. He's having some uh, hydraulic problems. So we're going to get it up and see if the hydraulic tank is operating 
uh, the way it's supposed to and figure out what's going on. Alright guys, so we found a leak in the tank, so we're going to take it off and put another one on. truth oh yeah low and slow baby yep seems to be working fine all right buddy there she is you have a good one guys it's gotten late here I want to shut these doors and we're going to be working probably half the night on the Ford because I want to get this 23 Ford done we just got a little bit left to do a little bit of paint and she's going to be ready so this should be ready in the morning let's get it squat squad so we got the Ford done last night and I even got up early enough this morning that I got online for the online auctions and I bought two more trucks so we're gonna pull out the Ford get the trailer hooked up and we're gonna go pick up these two trucks I bought this morning so stick around and see what we bought all right guys here she is man there was so much we've done we added the uh the bull bar to the front jtx forged rims fox suspension uh let's see we uh paint matched the 350 logo and we paint matched the magnum rack Man, this thing is just sick. All right. And we put a two-inch lift on it with the Fox shocks and suspension. So, and it's air ride. So, let's get this out and uh, let's get this thing hooked up and rolling. guys let's see only give about 1500 for this one it's uh that's a little rough but the motor runs so we're gonna get it I might turn it to like an off-road vehicle or something strip it down see what we can do with it uh, this one just needs washed um, uh, I don't know about if I'm going to make my money back on this or if I'm just going to any level it or 
definitely going to have to put some different rims on it. So let's get them back and I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do to them. Alright guys, it's all strapped down. Let's get out of here. Alright guys, so I've come up with my idea. I'm going to strip this down and we're going to turn it into more of a off-road mudding vehicle. Um, maybe jack it up a little bit and uh, see if we can sell that. And then this one, with that load of new parts, I got a new any level uh, suspension and some new rims and stuff that uh, I think would look really good on this and I think we're going big like I'm going I'm going huge with this truck um, definitely going to stand out and uh, I'm hoping it's going to sell fast so let's get into this alright squad squad we got the Chevy up on the rack and we got the power wagon over in the other building and we're going to get ready to start stripping it and get this thing painted and uh, see what kind of monstrosity we can turn this thing into alright squad squad so we got done with the power wagon but I just had a customer pull up and uh, he's got a KLX and uh, he's having some misfire problems so we're going to tear this down and see if we can't figure out what the problem with it is so let's get it in the shop alright so we got it in the shop and um, it's definitely missing so let's get it tore down and see if we can't figure this out Alright guys, we got it all broke down. We had a burnt intake valve and we're going to get that fixed and we're going to get it put back together right quick. Alright squat squat we got it back together and it is sounding amazing. We're going to take it down the road and make sure it's running right. Alright squad squad so we got back it's gotten a little late on us and uh, but everything is running great we're going to get it loaded back up in the back of the truck and get him on his way and then we're going to present the power wagon and then tomorrow we're going to start on the LP5 so stick with us.
All right, guys, the power wagon is done and it's time to present it. Oh, yeah. We stripped off all the fenders, lifted it two inches, put a light bar and a winch. We put bigger size tires. We got bars in the back with lights. And this thing is ready to go. Let's go mud bogging in this thing here soon. Uh, let's get it out and look at it. Oh yeah, that is a sick off-road truck right there. That should sell pretty fast. So, we're going to head to the house. We're going to get a little sleep and pretty get started on this LP5 in the morning. We'll see you in the morning. Good morning, squad squad. So, we got it the power wagon done we got the frame for the high country being welded and fabricated in the in the fabrication shop we got a customer coming this morning he just called and said he'd be on his way and I got a guy that has a 06 cat eye for sale and he's gonna bring it by and let me check it out so Alright guys, I think this is the customer that just pulled up. Jeez. The rust on that thing. Dents. Oh man, we're going to have to get the big dent puller. And see what we can do about this rust. And yeah, a lot of body work. But he's got it looking halfway decent. Color matching. I mean, for it to be an O2, it's in good shape. So let's get it in the shop and uh, get some of these dents pulled. All right, guys, we've been banging and cutting away at this uh, <laughs> this rust. Let's go see what this uh, cat eye looks like. All right, you want eight grand? All right, I'll tell you what, I'll test drive it, and if I like it, I'll drop you off, and I'll go drop you off with cash. Deal? All right, hop in. All right, guys, we're back to the shop. We're going to lower the O2 down and see if we can't cut some of this rust off and get some of it fabricated and welded back. And we're going to get it over to the other shop and get it painted and get these dents pulled. So stick around and see how this turns out. So we got it done. We got it all welded up and paint matched back and it looks sweet. It took us about all day. So let's get this out and look at it before it starts getting too dark. Yeah. 
Yeah, buddy, ain't no problem. Uh, we just pulled the dents and we got it all flushed up and welded. And lucky enough, we had paint to match. And uh, yeah, so I hope you like it. And uh, you have a good one, buddy. We'll see you next time. All right, Squatch Squad. That's it for this episode of Squatch Customs. In the next one, we're going to reveal the High Country Any Level build. We got the Cat Eye build to go. And we're going to get the first gen done. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. And I hope you all return for the next episode of Squatch Customs. Thanks for being part of the Squatch Squad. And thanks for squatching. Peace out and God bless.